Baby Opossum faces serious trouble before an unlikely hero steps in. Like most baby animals, the North American Opossum can't go too far without maternal guidance. These little guys desperately need their mothers to cling on to. This is how they receive warmth, protection, and milk. And without his mother, Pancho the Opossum was in serious trouble. Just barely out of the pouch, Pancho was already an orphan when rescue workers found him lying on the side of the road. He was clinging to the body of his mother, who'd just been struck by a car. Without her or a lot of help, his chances of survival were slim, but rescue workers had a plan just crazy enough to work. As a baby opossum, Pancho didn't have too much responsibility. After growing strong in his mother's pouch, he graduated to clinging to her side as she carried him around from place to place. Life was good. That was, until disaster struck. One night, Pancho's mother was struck by a car. She made it to the side of the road, but eventually, her strength gave out and she passed away, leaving little Pancho all alone in the world. When rescue workers eventually found Pancho, he was still clinging to his mother's body. He didn't know how to behave without her or where to go. Now an orphan, he wasn't going to survive unless the someone acted fast. So rescuers took Pancho to the Rare Species Fund, a wildlife organization in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, that was home to all kinds of exotic animals. There, veterinarians provided food, support, and medical treatment. But still, Pancho needed a mother. Of course, rescue workers didn't exactly have a few spare opossum mothers lying around, so they were going to have to get creative if they were to find a maternal figure for Pancho. Who could fill the role? Enter Hantu, a beautiful, white German shepherd. She had no puppies of her own, but with that maternal instinct in her, the rescue team figured she'd make the perfect mother for an opossum in need. It didn't take long for Pancho and Hantu to form a bond, but naturally, Hantu had to have a few shortcomings, right? There was no way a dog was going to be okay with carrying a side-cleaning opossum around like an ordinary opossum mom, or was there. Actually, Pancho hardly seemed to notice his new mom wasn't an opossum. He clung right to her side as he would his own mother. More surprising, Hantu didn't seem to mind the hanger-on one bit. Believe it or not, opossums have been around since the age of dinosaurs, and at about 70 million years old, they're one of the oldest species on the planet. But in all those years, no one likely saw one clinging to a dog until Pancho and Hantu came around. Of course, as Pancho grew older, he wouldn't be able to cling to his canine mother any longer, right? After all, adult opossums can grow to nearly two feet long and weigh upwards of 20 pounds. But wait for a second. Even as an older opossum, Pancho still hitched a ride on the back of his adoptive mom. Together, the duo traipsed through the wooded area on the rescue's property, no doubt making Pancho feel right at home. Strange as this relationship seemed on the surface, it was even stranger when you look at the differences between dogs and opossums. For one, in suburban areas, dogs, along with cars, are the biggest threats to opossums. Under normal circumstances, when an opossum spots a dog, he might play dead. This way, he could trick the dog into thinking he's no good to eat and not a threat. Talk about effective. Still, despite what their natural relationship would be like had Pancho not grown up with Hantu, this opossum was as comfortable as could be alongside his adoptive mother. Just look at how relaxed they both seemed together. This odd but cute couple did more than just raise a few eyebrows and melt hearts. They helped further Rare Species Fund's mission, the education of the public about conservation issues through the use of animal ambassadors. How'd they do that, you ask? Well, opossums have never exactly been the most beloved creatures in suburbia, with hairless, rat-like tails, mouths full of razor-sharp teeth, and a fondness for digging through trash cans, they can be a little off-putting to find in anyone's backyard. People often see them as pests. But for all their perceived faults, they truly are sweet creatures. Paula Goldberg, the executive director at City Wildlife in the District of Columbia, said that opossums do a wonderful job to keep things in balance 
in our neighborhoods, and in our forests. Ultimately, their bad rap, Paula argued, was unjustified. They don't carry diseases, they aren't aggressive, and their diet of roadkill and trash actually allow them to clean up communities. Maybe the opinion on opossums won't change overnight, but when cute little guys like Poncho team up with doggies like Hantu, it might help ease the minds of those who aren't sure what to think of the opossums digging in their dumpsters. Hopefully, Hantu and Poncho's unique friendship will encourage people to not be so afraid of opossums. You can see more of this dynamic duo by checking out the video below. How cute are these two? Watching these two together is heartwarming. Poncho is like a toddler who's too big for his stroller, but refuses to give it up. And Hantu, of course, is like his protective mama. Share this wonderful friendship with your friends and family.